you've turned on to rock and roll. Huh. Baby metal, Tim Henson, Scott Lee Page from Polyphia, <laughs> MV, let's go. That's <laughs> <laughs> Scotty LePage. <laughs> well, it says Scott. <laughs> What? Lies! <laughs> it's, it's, it says Scott. <laughs> his Instagram says Scotty. <laughs> uh, I don't know how much I kept in there, guys, but no, we do have a newer song with Baby Metal and Brand New Day featuring Tim Henson and Scotty Lee Page from Polyphia. Yes, mm -hmm. um, there is no lyrics, guys, so we're just here for the vibe and mm -hmm. see what these guys are going to do with Baby Metal. I'm stoked. Yeah. So, guys, just to be clear, I know that there's probably going to be a lot of comments that are going to be like, dude, react to Neurotica, react to Iconic. Guys, he plays those. I play those songs, listening to them, and also struggle to learn to play them. <laughs> Eric has Eric has heard those songs a million times. You messed that part up. Yeah, a lot. Yeah. So, <laughs> but um, no. So, like, we we did do a, a reaction to Iconic. Well, actually, no, it was a re uh, reaction you did. It was a hip hop head reacts, but that was like we just didn't long ago. It just we we break down lyrics. Like that's really like that's our main thing. Usually, we, yes. we have like a vibe of. Of, of that kind so but um no we will not be reacting to polyphia because there's really no room to react to anything but this one is baby metal we have yeah. plenty of room to react to them and they're with tim henson and sky lepage like dude I'm, I'm about it so like, I'm, I'm just i'm ready for this so i want to know how they're going to you know bring brand, a new, brand day. new day in <laughs> so yeah all right welcome back you music junkies I'm Eric. I'm the hip-hop head. I'm Kyle. I'm the metal head. And we're brothers that react to shit, so let's do that. Tonight we have Baby Metal, Brand New Day, featuring Tim Henson and Scotty Lee Page from Polyphia. Okay, let's do it. Oh. As always, their live shows are incredible. Yeah. Not the vibe I was thinking. Give it time. Hmm. Oh, oh, there, there they are. Oh, the crowd can do better than that, guys. You're seeing baby metal. Mm hmm. Oh, oh, that's cool. Brubs, you know it's their show. <laughs> and they have eight strings. Oh, shit. We're in trouble. Or at least, at least Tim does. There we go. Look at him just cheesing. Oh. Oh. Oh, God, it's tasty. This is everything I wanted. Oh. 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 Okay, wait a minute. All right. All right. Dude. <laughs> So <laughs> the fact with, okay, so I know baby metal has this like, you know, kind of in your face sound and stuff, even on their own, mm -hmm. it's really cool to, to hear them regardless of being able to understand their lyrics at the moment, but mm -hmm. th their, their tonality and stuff with Polyphia yeah. on how their style is and it, dude, they, they, they mix really well. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Like this was like, it was meant to be. And the fact that Tim's just standing there fucking smiling <laughs> yeah. while he plays this shit. Yeah. It's well, disgusts me. And I'm not even a guitar player. <laughs> well, it's, I think what's interesting too, is that especially off their uh, new album, remember that you will die. Like, dude, like they actually had quite a bit of vocals on that album. And it's like, wow, like this actually does work. Cause mm -hmm. I, cause one of the things I heard whenever they were first starting was that when they sent demos, the response they got was, this is great. Where's the vocalist. 
And they were like, well, we, we don't have one. We don't have so, one. But, um, That's not but what no, we do. But no, kind of like the first time that I ever heard vocals be put on top of something was actually the collab that Tim did with Tillian. Uh, well, he's no, no longer with Dance Gavin Dance, but what he did a collab with him. And there was yeah. just this really good just riff that he did the entire time. It was like, well, like, so this is what Polyphia would sound like with vocals. It, right. And then they just honed into it or whatever. Like, dude, like, this is really amazing. It and, is. Like, this song has, like, it has a bigness to it that makes sense. It was done with it, this live music video, yeah, dude. This, yeah. This is incredible. This is okay. So great. Let's back this up a little bit and get back into it. Let's do it. Mm. That, do, 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 like, yeah, yeah. Oh. Oh. The fact that she's singing, but her, but the other two are still up front being present. Yeah. I like that. Yeah. It's not one person stage. Mm. Oh. Come on. Come on. I would say this has no business being this good, but it does. I really wish Tim and Scotty would have brought it a little harder, you know? <laughs> <laughs> It's like they're just not even. No, it's effortless. Dude. Good oh, God. my God. Yes. <laughs> yeah, dude. <laughs> God. Incredible. This, this was great, man. It's, I mean, you go. Well, you well, go. I, yeah, you I go. was going to say right right off the rip, guys, in the fact of, no, we didn't pause per se a lot and break. We, we couldn't understand what, the, what you mm. know, they were singing. So we did have a little bit of a handicap. But the fact that mm. we were just able to uh, groove. And, and just be in the moment with this, mm -hmm. I, I think still says a lot for the song itself because we are pretty much lyric driven, but mm -hmm. when you have talent like this between baby metal and Polyphia, yeah. you, you, you got to show up yeah. and, you know, give the support and, and, and watch the, the art and just the talent be, you know, in front of you. So like, this was yeah. incredible. The girls have such a great voice. And I think that's why it was so interesting to, like you said, hear like Polyphia mm. per se have lyrics behind something. Right. Even though we didn't really understand it, it was interesting to have that other layer of it. Yeah. So dude, 10 out of 10 fucking 10. And the fact I swear, I'm not trying to be funny. I swear to God, they panned to Scotty and it was like, he was just petting his guitar. <laughs> yeah. I was like, what the fuck? How do you bro? Dude, it's, there's been plenty Save of some pussy for the rest of us. There's, there's been plenty of times that like, especially like, cause I, I've tried to learn both Tim and Scott's parts, depending on like what's being done. 
And what I've always told people is that it's like like Polyphia's uh, guitar work. It's what's ironic is that the techniques that they use are simple. It's the fact of the execution of that. Yeah, you'll be doing a little trill and doing your thing, but you better learn how to slide all over the place while you're doing <laughs> yeah. that. Trill. Like it's like they just they Frankenstein a bunch mm-hmm. of different things together, and they do. Uh, I think what Tim calls flexing, where it's like, yeah, you have a chord progression, no flex on it. Like make it intense, make it like you know, like really good. Like just I could go on a whole hour long podcast talking about their guitar techniques, and I won't do that. But dude, it's just it's awesome to see that they vibe with them because dude, like baby metal is just so damn talented. Like just yes. with what they do, and especially with the band that is also behind them, because like we've heard them go like super heavy before. Mm-hmm. So and I think upon further inspection, I think that it may have been a normal six string guitar that Tim was using. So but oh, uh, oh okay okay. At first, it looked like one of his um, uh, signature eights that he used for Reverie, but I don't think that was that it was that one. But nevertheless, though, dude. Dude, this was just this was this was a treat. This was just sure. shut your brain off, have a great time, and just and watch the spectacle unfold like before One, you do. One hundred percent. This was so good. Like I want to know what studio time was like with them to make. Oh this. Like, yeah. Dude, like any behind the scenes, all that stuff. I am there for it, dude. This is so. Damn I wanted that too. Like who wrote the who wrote this? Was it Tim or Baby Metal? Because it fucking matters. Like, yeah, right. yeah. <laughs> yeah. I want to know who who deserves credit. So, but yeah, yeah, man, this is wild. I love it, man. Me too. Yeah. So, guys, this was amazing. We really cannot wait to go through more. I hope they do more stuff together. And remember. How did we get Dick from Richard? And if you liked what you saw, you know what to do. Hit the like button and subscribe. That way you never miss an upload. And watch just two idiots rags of stuff. Comment down below if you want to see anything else. We'll get you as soon as we can. And we'll see you next time. Cheers. That's a damn good question. Uh, <laughs> Adios. <laughs> Adios. It's fucking way different.